My name is Kenneth from Merchant Tech Release. Today we are going to be doing a video about the iPhone 5 rumors and is the iPhone 3GS outselling the iPhone 4? It's all coming up after this intro. Stay tuned, you're watching Next in Reviews. So, as I said earlier, the iPhone 3GS may be outselling the iPhone 4. In a lot of YouTube videos, the 3GS videos, some are new, actually. And, um, actually newer than the iPhone 4 since the price dropped to $50. Which may have something to do with this, but a lot of videos on the 3GS are getting more views. Take our video, for example. My iPhone 4 video was a week earlier than my brother's iPhone 3GS video. As you can see, the iPhone 3 weeks earlier. This is, hello, my name is Kenneth. From and then, if we go over here, 2 weeks earlier, you have double the views. Over double the views on the 3GS video than we did on the 4. It's really awkward, I guess. And, well, this could mean that we will see a definite redesign within the iPhone um, 5. We could see a definite redesign if this keeps happening. Um, so, I love my iPhone 4, and my brother loves his 3GS. But this whole iPhone 3GS, the older version of the iPhone, selling more New Day than now, the iPhone 4 is just really above my head. Why? Now that we've got that covered, we should mention that the iPhone 4 may have an 8 megapixel camera. And the camera may be developed by Sony as they are working with 8 megapixel cameras right now. As some people say it was leaked in an interview. But this interview has yet to be seen by us at MGR. So that may or may not be true about the Sony, but it probably will have an 8 megapixel. And also something that may not happen, but I really, really hope it happens, is the aluminum back. The iPod Touch has an aluminum back, and I just, I hope they bring a curved aluminum back so it fits in your hand like the 3GS did. Um, my brother over there has a 3GS, um, and it feels really good in my hand, unlike my blocky iPhone 4. I like the design and everything, but I'm not a fan of glass on the back. It looks good. But that durability, if you drop it by an accident, like if you just touch your case off, which you should wear a case, this is volcano slider. But, um, you know, the, it just, if you take the case off and you drop the phone, it's just really gonna, Lucas? Let me say a little something, guys. And yes, my name is Lucas from Next I would say the iPhone 3 Jet feels a lot better at the end. And, Today, we will be giving away stuff like mouse pads, yes, or MGR, you know, stuff like that, cool stuff. We're giving and away free mouse pads to anyone who subscribes and comments. All you have to do is subscribe and comment saying mouse pad. We will randomly pick a winner from a list on a website that random the name. Yes, that is guaranteed. It will be random. And that, you know, mouse pads, we're giving them away. I need one. Um, they are over there, but, you know, we will be giving you mouse pads. And, you know, of course, it's great. Alright, back to the iPhone 4. Um, the iPhone 5. Remember, they just keep continuing. And I really hope it has an one on the back, which is curved. Um, I think they can still manage to make it thinner, even though it is curved. Um, it just feels a lot better in your hand. Not saying anything bad about the iPhone 4. It feels good in your hand, but the iPhone 4, 3GS feels great in your hand. Um, may I say a little something? Sure. <laughs> yeah. Um, I would say I love the iPhone 4, but the only thing bad about it is I'm not a fan of black. But, um, Apple claims that it's 30 times stronger than plastic. Oh. I, I honestly don't believe that. Heck How no. many people have cracked their phones by an accident? It's just, I wish they would come up with some kind of 
thing on the front that looks, feels, and basically is glass, yeah. but it's so much more durable, you know? If you drop your phone in the front from really high on a concrete floor, I know this is probably going to be impossible, but Apple's an impossible company. Um, as far as their products go, it's really, um, you never know what they're going to do. So I hope they improve, you know, something that looks like glass or really, really strong glass, but if you drop it on hard ceiling floor, it's going to be fine if you accidentally drop it like that. Because as you see, I only buy cases that come over the screen like this skull candy slider. Alright, um, I love my 3GS, and you might be seeing a video of my app. And I hope you guys will like this video. Um, it's gonna be pretty good, you know. Okay, so that's it for this. And, I mean, that's pretty much all to talk about. I, it will be on AT&T and Verizon, almost guaranteed. Um, but I do also hope that they add some just new features, you know. Stay tuned for the next video, which is either gonna be this app or iTunes 10.4. Is the iTunes 10.4 logo that they put on Apple's website hinting at new features that weren't announced at WWDC 2011 at about iCloud? Stay tuned to the next video. Hey. See you later. This is Kenneth from Next Gen Review. This is Lucas from Next Gen Review signing out. Make sure to tell your friends, comment, tell us how we did, subscribe, and remember, if you want updates of when iOS 5 and when the iPhone 5 more rumors, all you have to do is subscribe and leave your name and email at the bottom, and we will email you as soon as we get iOS 5 out and ready. And also iPhone 5 and any other stuff, we will email you about new updates that you wouldn't get from other tech reviewers about that. So thank you for watching. Just leave your name and email address. This is Kenneth from Action Review. That's what it's for next year with you. Remember to sign up for the giveaway. See you guys later.